Welcome back, everybody. January went faster than a dozen eggs on sale. Since time is flying, I won't make you wait another minute for your monthly provider highlights for February. So sit back, relax, and let's get into it. Starting with February celebrations. There are so many February holidays and observances that are worth acknowledging. There's Black History Month, which is recognized all month long where we get to honor the contributions and accomplishments of African-Americans. And of course, we're all ready to pull on our red and pink to celebrate romantic love, self-love, and everything in between with Valentine's Day. Fortunately, the celebrating doesn't stop there. Let's not forget about the three-day weekend that usually accompanies President's Day. And don't forget the sales. We also get to enjoy the spectacle and fun behind Puxatawney Field's hypothesis on just how long winter will last on Groundhog's Day. Needless to say, February presents several opportunities to brush up on your history, increase awareness, and indulge in traditions. Click on the link below to learn about all of February's holidays and celebrations. Speaking of celebrating, congratulations to Marion County's own Pioneer Child Care last month's winner of our provider update raffle. While we call programs for updates all month long, we shake things up a little towards the end of the month. So remember, the third Tuesday and Thursday of every month between 1 and 3 p.m. is a chance to be entered into our provider update raffle. So don't hesitate, your program could be next. Oh, buddy, hey, grant opportunity. Did you know United Way of Central Indiana has announced their Empower to Educate Workforce Stabilization and Renewal Grant? The purpose of this grant is to help the ECE providers community to feel empowered and rejuvenated. The Empower to Educate Workforce Stabilization and Renewal Grant will allow childcare facilities to give their staff members an opportunity to celebrate and to proclaim themselves as impactful educators. Applications are open to pass to quality levels one through four child care providers located in Boone, Hamilton, Hancock, Hendricks, Marion, Morgan, and Putnam counties, and identify as registered ministries or traditional child care centers. Applications are due by 5 p.m. on February 24th, 2023 and any applications submitted after 5 p.m. will not be considered. Applicants will be informed of funding decisions by March 24th, 2023. If you are interested in applying, please click on the link below. You may also send any questions to the email address listed below. All right, you guys, time for your professional development alert. All right, providers, it's not too late to get your taxes right. If you own your child care business, paying taxes can sometimes be tricky, and you can end up paying a huge tax bill when you file your tax return. Worry no more. Score small business webinar, how to pay small business taxes strategically to avoid one big bill. It's just one click away. Click on the link below to register and learn from expert presenter Joseph McCarthy, CPA, tax specialist and communications liaison for the IRS on how to avoid penalties by estimating your taxes and choosing the best way to pay your taxes using different IRS payment options. Well, that about covers it. Thank you for taking time out of your busy day and I hope you enjoyed listening to this month's highlights. I'll catch you guys next month. Bye-bye.